this is the structure of the ten dimensions that we hear so much so much about the important thing to understand is that the ten dimensions have got a structure and this is it and uh, the first thing you should understand is that the dimensions are different they're built one on top of another but not only one on top of another they interlock into this structure the structure consists of three triangles so you can see these three triangles have been on top of one another now there's this structure that I've used to show the unified field theory there we've got the quant level of quantum mechanics their level of relativity and their level of gravity and I've also used it in the developmental psychology beginner's mind to show you how the development of the ten dimensions one on top of the other follows the development of our minds in a structure of a mind of interlock locking structure again consisting of these three triangles I've also shown this is a, an autonomous system and in the artificial intelligence control system as a structure consisting again of these three triangles always one integrated whole system this triangle is the attention there's the eye following the point moving on the surface there's the distance senses the audio triangle that's the video triangle this is the audio triangle and so this is the next thing of being in a different place at a different time our schedule our distance things that we're moving towards this is the relativity and then the gravity triangle which is the pressure signal which gives us our if you like our immediate reality what we're in touch with what we call now and is that that movement of these three three movements you know in the structure of mind in the structure of the autonomous system in the development of our mind you see so it's a common science model and that's this is what we need so we've got a structure in which the science can immediately relate to each other and in which we can also learn and contribute obviously there's lots more in the separate theories that I put forward to on this structure of the ten dimensions but the primary thing is that we've got the ten dimensions and that they have a structure and then obviously following on that structure everything the physical and, and the psychological must be built upon the same structure this unified science model